everyone, Luther here. Welcome back to more Golden Sun Lost Age. <coughs> uh, in the last episode, we got the uh, Great Gabamba's, uh, I mean, Pierce's jewel back from the Catacombs of the Great Gabamba. And this episode, we are going to be traveling back across the mountains. It, now, here is where the genius of Capcom's... Uh, not Capcom's. Capcom didn't make this game. That is stupid. Um... Now I lost my train of thought. Thank you, Pixie. <laughs> if Capcom made this game, I would be very worried. <laughs> uh, not that I don't like Capcom's RPGs, but some of them suck. Like, uh, Mega Man Battle Network 4. <laughs> that one sucks. Now, we should go over that if I ever come on playing this game with the shiny really do not want to do because it sucks that bad. <coughs> the other Mega Man Battle Networks I don't really mind, but for no. In any case, here I go thinking this is a Super Nintendo game again! I am so stupid today, I do not even know why I'm doing that. Anyway, the genius of Camelot's level design is that there are two paths you can actually take for this mount. One for a team of fire, water, and wind adepts, and Another for a single, uh, water, fire, earth, and wind at it, excuse me, and the other for a single water at it. Which is really smart, because, I mean, think about it, there was really no way Pierce should have gotten here if he couldn't get here on his own. It is just that amazing. Anyway, I need to turn you into a glute so you can... Divine. If there's one thing to say about Dark Dawn, I am glad that they uh, gave Matthew a growth spell by default. Because that is totally... <clears throat> well, I don't know, it's just that much more of a convenient... Yeah, Why am I being so stupid today with my R button? Staking it for X like that, I am such an idiot. Um... There. Now let us save our state, I suppose. And yes, we know you are upset. Right. I want to say Jupiter is weak to either Earth or uh, to either Venus or Mercury. Let's try it. <coughs> An interesting thing I discovered about the Ragnarok and uh, Diamond Dust spells, I'm pretty sure they're based on physical attack power. Um, they might all be based on physical attack power, but... Yeah, you know how in RPGs people usually have physical and magical attack power, so I guess that's what I'm trying to say. Of course, I could be completely wrong here in what I read, but anyway, we found Waft. Calm a foe with soothing sense. That brings, uh, you up to Mage. And you actually get some defensive spells for a change. It's nice. <coughs> if only I could get you your other set of and stuff that would be awesome. You know, that's the thing. Why haven't I found four uh, Mars Jin yet? It's not like they're hard to find any. There's 18 of them total if you include the uh, seven from the first game. <laughs> yeah, four of them. This game connects to the first game. Uh, but anyway... <coughs> Let's please just go. I don't want to have to watch this battle any more than the viewers do! Come on! Die already! Thank you! There's one thing to say about really liking RPGs is that they are impossible to let's play without somebody getting frustrated. Oh boy. Assassin. Can I assassinate you before you do it again? Yes, I can assassinate you. 
Hey-ho! or something. I am probably speaking way too quietly for anything to really matter today. And of course he is falling for it because he has stayed up all night trying to do things. Also Jenna is poisoned at his At least this is not like, you know, badly poisoned. Like where she loses a whole bunch of HP and there's nothing you can do about it. <coughs> Except maybe cure poison. In any case. Well, 19 Commander, not bad. Here's not bad at all. Anyway, here we are back in this place. Um, dang it, reveal! No! Ugh. Why do I keep doing that? I am such an idiot. You actually have equipment I can sell. Um, I was checking to see if I got the laughing mushroom from the cliffs. I don't think I did. More importantly than that, there is stuff I can sell. These will be useless to everybody. I can't sell this, it's a plot artifact. I don't want to sell the pure stone here. The forgeable items in this game are amazing. <coughs> First I'm gonna hang on to. There we go, actually pressing the right button this time. Uh, let's press the... the okay, I already got that. Yes, in case it hasn't been clear, it has been months on end since I have played this game last. Uh, I guess it's just part of being so busy, you know? I mean, episode 70, that was recorded today, but uh, with this episode, episode 71, is my real first recording attempt in like And if you guys remember from whatever episode we were in before, 67, I would say, we, uh, <coughs> we encountered a gym here that we couldn't do anything about. Flash Ants, you can just die. <coughs> I do not like you. Now we have tears in the party, we can actually swap them in the next one. Get going. At least I think it was a gym that we couldn't immediately turn to the gay or the same song. Hey, you have a kitty face. Kitty face. This is what we want, the one of them. That will allow us to get a thing back in Madra, which is why I'm going to Madra instead of straight to the ship. That is what I wanted to get before, but it <coughs> actually doesn't serve any real purpose in the game, it's just kind of a fake. It's a red herring, you know, it's pretty good already. The reason we want that one is... Where am I? We 
Mini Goblin, you can just die. You are not even worth my time anymore. I should be casting a boy. Such a thing when you're recording a game. In any case, Madra. We want to take it to this guy with the two-story house here. Get it to the top of the Now have four. <coughs> and as is usual with the accompany loud sound effects, we have found a new partner. This is Char. Batter fried mushrooms. Is it really that big? I didn't think it was that big. Oh well. Uh, paralyzed foes with a strong blow. But more importantly than that, we can now. Unequip her from being a pirate. And she is now a hex. And what that means is she has healing spells now. Jenna is going to be our main medic, probably through the rest of the game until we get a certain other character. This lady here has something to say. That was some weird collision detection. Anyway, what we want to do now we have here is actually go down here and there is a summon we can get, finally. Uh, we just need to find a place with the uh, water. Yeah. <coughs> do not ignore, I uh, do not mind me and my grave illness because it's not really illness at all, it is a thing, and probably should be keeping her on avoid duty. Her or Felix. How does that change your stats, Felix? 174 attack, 132 defense, 97 agility. Versus... Okay, I'm going to have to compare those, but I think it actually makes Felix weaker. Oh. so much time on that, but I do not care. It's probably less time than we would waste from random encounters, and I am going in completely the wrong way, huh? Uh, this path. Was this path always sealed off like that? I want to say no, but I don't know. It's been ages since I played this game. I can't expect it to remember all the details. I guess it's good that you can only find her with peers because at this point, if that wasn't sealed off, it would be now, so the thing happens. In any case, you can actually cast Tremor here, uh, one of the many uses we have for Tremor. Actually, makes a treasure chest fall to the floor below. Which, as you might have guessed, makes a thing happen. Uh, we 
you cannot reveal a hole in the wall there, so there's probably not a hole in the wall there. You know, it's a bomb. Of um. Oh, there is a thing here, though. It's a mist potion. That is an excellent party healing item, but. Well, you know me, I almost never use items. <laughs> it just doesn't occur to me to use an item, that's just the thing. Here. Get a ruined key. Don't remember where we can use this. But it is a place within this ruin. I know that. And it's a mysterious shrine to Moloch. Wasn't that more a god of the some other region besides India? <laughs> I want to say so. I don't know very much about ancient cultures, but it sounds like a thing. Two Mercury, one Jupiter standby. I guess I can show off the sun. Um, as soon as the void wears off. Obviously is a water elemental flame. I guess we shall see what added effect it has since all of the multi-elemental summons have some crazy added effect to them for some reason. There. Oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> that just looks all kind of silly. There's a sign that. Actually, why am I even bothering to do that? It's not like I feel it's a stats of the kind of thing that I have multiple ones quick. Ah, you stupid thing. Stupid thing. It's a stupid thing. I have no idea what time it even is, but we've probably spent. Hello. <coughs> yeah, she's dead. You're her sister? Oh, well, okay, just thought I'd tell you. Ah, uh, strange lady. Felix, you're back! And you brought Piers with you. Oh, Piers! Piers, I must apologize for the trouble we've been causing you. I'm sorry we lost your jewel. Okay, I'm gonna stop. It's a matter of a puzzle. You know. The thing. <coughs> that would like to be a thing the girl out front. Give me a hug, Piers! Uh, yeah, we've pretty much done all we can do in Madra. 
Now is a lengthy sector of the game. But we can finally move on to better areas. Uh, let's talk. Yeah. <laughs> well, you know. Felix, wait! the truth I honestly don't remember. Okay. Hey. Oh, wow! A cyclone chip! Um... You know what it can be? Felix, uh-oh. You. He just called you Felix, didn't he? Why didn't I see it before? You are Felix! Marty should be somewhere around here, too, if I'm yet. You won't see Minardi or Sathros ever again. Isaac could them. Probably at the bottom of the sea by now. Sheba, quiet! Is my sister dead? I can't believe it. No one has the power to defeat Satros and my sister. Can't you all avoid my gaze and that look on your faces? It is true. Who is this Isaac? What? You feign ignorance? Why? Would you protect him from my fury? Never mind. I believe I've heard some rumors of travel and diving lately. Is Isaac the same one they've been speaking of? Is he pursuing you? That is the case, Miss Isaac should show up here sooner or later. How do you know it wasn't Felix who defeated your sister? What are you taking me for? I'm a warrior, like my sister. I can gauge your man's strength with a single glance. Even if you doubled Felix's power, he would still be no match for my sister. I don't know about that. I seem to clearly remember beating Thatros and Minardi at, like, level 30-something. Felix is level 20 right now, isn't he? And besides, I doubt Felix would find it in himself to betray my sister. He knows that the lives of those he holds dear would hang in the balance. But I must congratulate you both on your on your successes at both the Mercury and Venus lighthouses. All your success there now prevents us from returning to the Western Sea. We would have failed, of course, had we not researched how to climb the lighthouses. Oh, didn't Minari tell you? Regardless, Isaac won't be getting in my way. You'll have to find your own way to the Western Sea. If you make the journey, you'll have to light Jupiter on your own as well. We have our own work to do, and number one on the list is taking care of Isaac. Are we clear on this, Felix? I kind of creepy, Mrs. Lady. If you're worried you can't get it done, we could help you. We could help you a bit. No, thank you. I believe we'll just find Jupiter Lighthouse on our own. It's all the same. I see. Don't let us down. We're going to find that Isaac. I'm going to find this Isaac. And I swear that the last thing he sees will be Karst avenging the death of her dear sister. Wow. I thought Satros and Anardi had issues. We shouldn't take Karst too lightly. Wait a moment. Karst did say we, didn't she? Yes. Satros and Anardi travel as a pair. Perhaps she has a partner as well. We want to warn Isaac that Karst is after him. Maybe we should try to find him first. Believe me, I'd love to see Isaac again, but we just don't have time to look for him. Plus... Even if we did find him, I think there's a good chance we end up fighting him. Why? What we are trying to achieve, they are trying to prevent, and they will fight to stop us. Hannah, aren't you giving Isaac an item? Couldn't you, you know, do something? And I don't know! I mean, it's not like that! Not really? Stupid Shiva. <laughs> it 
<laughs> Don't you mean Isaac? <laughs> <laughs> oh, this game is so silly. Nope. <laughs> oh, come on, you didn't even let me answer no this time. You're boring. Uh, that being said, it is probably about time we end this episode, so... See you guys next time! <laughs> <laughs> Jesus.